Hey guys, so today I'm gonna to be using a custom color fashion dread. I'm gonna be installing it onto my client's hair. So first things first is I'm gonna braid on my fashion dread so it blends perfectly with my client's hair. And I'm just gonna keep braiding until my, my braid meets the beginning of the fashion dread. So keep braiding, keep braiding, and then take that loose hair and wrap it. Wonderful. Now I'm gonna take my Afro Kinky, oh yeah. I'm gonna use color number 1B because that's gonna match the top of her hair. And I'm gonna blend it next to her scalp. So keep wrapping it until it goes close to her scalp so it can really blend in with her natural hair. Wonderful. And now I'm gonna take my color number two and I'm gonna blend it between the fashion dread and my color number 1B so that it kind of has like an ombre effect. And I'm gonna keep wrapping, wrapping, wrapping. And I'm gonna take my crochet hook and start crocheting. So I'm gonna crochet all the way down. I'm gonna keep crocheting, keep crocheting. And remember not to poke yourself. So I'm gonna keep crocheting all the way down. And it's really gonna start to blend very smoothly and perfectly and seamlessly, which is why I love using the crochet method. It's so amazing. Keep going down. Oh yeah. Keep going, keep going. Watch the nails flex. Hello. I'm gonna take my scissors and trim all the excess hair. And you can see that it's blending so well. And it looks amazing. Get all those little hairs. And bam, everything looks super great. And now you have blended using your African key hair, your fashion dread to your client's locks.